plug the USB cable firmly into the AC power adapter. Plug the other end of the cable into the unit's mini USB port. Note, you can power this unit also from a computer USB port. You can save images direct to an SD card up to 32 GB in capacity. Insert the card into the card reader with the gold contacts facing down. Push it all the way in until it clicks. To remove the card, push it again to eject. When you first start the unit, you will see the home menu. You can browse the home menu by pressing either the right or the left keys. From the home menu, you can change language. Select the USB mode to download saved images to a computer. Select photo size. Select effect for color or black and white. Format to erase internal memory or the memory card. Capture to go to the capture or scanning mode. And playback to playback saved images. To select an option from the home screen, press the left or the right key until you reach the option and press OK Enter button. To choose an option from the submenu again, use the left or the right key to highlight the option and press the OK key. If you're planning on saving images to an SD card, insert the SD card into the machine. Then press the power button. Home screen first option is photo size. Press enter OK key to access photo size selection options. The size options are 5x7, 4x6, 3x5, and business cards. Use the right or the left key to highlight your photo size. When you reach your photo size, press the OK Enter button. In this example, we have a 5x7 photo. Therefore, choose the 5x7 alignment bracket. Alignment bracket has pins on the back. Install the bracket into the top left corner and make sure the pin sits into the holes. Take your photo and lay it face down with the left upper corner pushed against the alignment bracket. Close the top cover. A preview of the photo will show on the display screen. Press the Convert button and the option to save will show on the lower left corner of the screen. Press the OK Enter button to save. Progress wheel will display for about 5 seconds. When it disappears, it means you are done with the photo. Remove the photo and set a new photo. Close the lid. The PD20 offers minor adjustment to the exposure value to darken or lighten the image and color adjustment. To access the adjustment menu at the preview or capture mode, press the OK Enter button. Four icons display on the screen. First to adjust brightness, second to adjust red color, third to adjust green color, and fourth to adjust blue color. You use the right arrow button to brighten an image or left arrow button to darken the image.
press the OK Enter button to finalize and the red cursor will move to the next option which is the red color adjustment. Same procedure, press the right arrow button to increase that color or left arrow button to reduce this color. Press the OK Enter button to jump to the next color and in this case the green. Press the Enter to jump to blue and enter again to exit adjust adjustment mode and back to the capture mode. EV value will show on the upper right corner of the screen. Other options, you can flip an image before converting by pressing the right arrow button. You can also mirror an image by pressing the left arrow button. To convert the photo to digital, you continue by pressing the Convert button and then Enter OK button to save. The PD-20 offers a playback mode to review all saved images. To select the playback mode, press the right or the left arrow button until you reach playback. Press Enter OK button to access playback. The unit will start a slideshow of saved images. You can pause at an image by pressing the OK Enter button. In the pause menu, you will see two yellow arrows. Pressing the left arrow button will allow you manually to go back one image at a time or forward by pressing the right arrow button. Displayed image file number will show on the upper left corner of the screen. Furthermore, if you press the Enter button, an editing menu will dis be displayed. In the editing menu, you can rotate the image 90 degrees clockwise. Ninety degrees counterclockwise. Trash the image, resume slideshow, resave an image, or exit to the home screen or the home menu. Also, you can exit the edit menu by pressing the OK Enter button. And to exit the playback, you could press the menu button. To upload saved images from the internal memory or from an SD card, plug the USB cable into the computer USB port. Press the power button. The unit will now draw power from the computer USB port. From the home screen menu, press the left arrow button until you reach USB MSDC and then press the Enter OK button. USB symbol will fill the screen with yellow arrows indicating the unit is now communicating with the computer. The computer will recognize the unit as the digital camera Follow the computer prompts to import saved images to your computer. If you feel the built-in color screen is too small, you can connect the PD20 to a TV via a 3.5 to the video RCA cable. Cable can be purchased from Wolverine Data website. With this cable, your TV becomes the display instead of the built-in screen. 